Good morning, fans. How is everyone doing? It's time for our weekly segment of Moments with Mima. Here's Mima. Say hi, Mima. Hi. We hope everyone is enjoying this holiday. Well, I guess tomorrow is technically the holiday. Do you know what the holiday is, uh, Mima? No. <clears throat> okay, do you know what the date is? Mm, it's winter. It's cold. It's not winter. Look outside. Do you see any snow out there or ice? Well, no. It's no. Always. It's darn near summer. Oh. It's definitely spring. We get like mid to late spring. And it is warm out. While I am sleeveless, you are sitting there bundled up in a jacket. So somebody figured that out. But we are coming up on Memorial Day. Mm-hmm. Do you remember what we used to do for Memorial Day? Mm-hmm. Remember we used to go to Aunt Mag's house? Of course you did. Mm-hmm. And always, what? What were you going to say? Eat. We'd have a lot of food to eat. And Mag and Uncle Kush. Aunt Mag and Uncle Kush. And what did the men do outside in the yard? Probably cut the grass. They did not cut the grass. Uncle Beachy and Uncle Morris and Uncle Kush. And a lot of the men would do the same activity every year outside. Sports, sports. It was sporting for them, yes. Can you imagine what they meant? They would pitch horseshoes. Oh, oh remember? <laughs> that was Uncle Morris's jam, pitching horseshoes. Okay, so we would have been at their house today. But for some reason, remember the weather would always get cold? It would either get cloudy or it would get rainy. And Aunt Mag had a ginormous yard, but a teeny tiny house. And we would end up jammed, like bunches of us, jammed in that little bitty teeny tiny house. So these are our memories. Okay, let me just state this for the record, even though I did type it. We do not own the rights to the music playing in the background. It's just easy listening jazz music. Don't anybody bother me about it. Okay, so, Mima, have you ever been out of the country? Never one. Have you ever been out of the country? Oh, no. Why are you saying it like that? Where am I going? Who's going to take me? <laughs> you can go any place you want to go. You're a full-grown woman. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Have you ever wanted to leave the country? Have you wanted to go? Yes. Yeah, but let's talk about that. It never crossed my mind. I, I guess I didn't think it was possible, so I didn't think about it. So you were content to just traipse around the United States? All right with me. Okay. Well, you know, there is a whole big country out there, and I want to visit some other countries. Dana and I talked about taking a trip together, which we plan to do at some point in time. We're still working it out. Ask me where I want to go. Where do you want to go? I want to go to Italy. Italy? Italy. Mm -hmm. Specifically, I want to go to Venice. And I want to ride in a gondola. I know they offer gondola rides someplace downtown, I believe, but I want to ride in a gondola in Venice. And while I'm in that gondola, my plan is to teach English to people who do not speak English. Oh. Now, I have been planning for that in that I have completed my TEFL certification. I've completed my TEFL certification. Can you say TEFL? TEFL. TEFL stands for Teaching English to Foreign Learners. So I have been certified to teach English to foreign learners. I've also been working on my health. First of all, in terms of weight loss, but generally in terms of health all the way around, because what I don't want to do is to get to a foreign country and get sick and either be stuck there because I'm sick or have to come home because I'm sick. So, if anyone is interested in how I got my TEFL certification or what I can do with it, or if anyone is interested in my weight loss journey and my journey to um, better health, just let me know and I will share with you what I've been working on. Well, if I'm going out of the country, Don't you think it's probably a good idea that I can speak the language where I end up? Yes, definitely. Definitely. 
because I think it's just kind of rude to expect everyone everywhere to speak English. I think we need to make some uh, concessions and try to meet people at least halfway. So this segment is dedicated to learning to speak another language. Us. Oh. You and me. Oh. We are going to learn to speak another language. Now, I can teach um, English anywhere. I can teach it here. I can teach it there. I can teach it everywhere. I would like, again, to be able to go to a foreign country to teach, but I could teach individuals, I could teach groups, I could teach person to person, I could teach online, and I think I'm probably going to start out practicing online when I actually start my teaching. I think for the purpose of today's segment, you and I are going to learn to speak Spanish. <coughs> Have you ever spoken Spanish? No. Why not? I didn't know no how. For one reason, nobody ever taught me. No one ever taught you? Okay, that's fair. Okay, we have a large segment of Spanish-speaking Spanish individuals. And oddly enough, I have had numerous occasions where people out in the public will walk up to me and just start speaking Spanish, as if for some reason they mm -hmm. assume I understand Spanish. I have never understood why that happens. I just know that I always end up looking at them like, and then they say, oh, you don't speak Spanish. Not at all. It's not true. I do know a few words. Let's see if I can remember all the words I know in Spanish. What is this? What is this? Table. A table. Okay. In Spanish, the word for table is mesa. 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 Yes. Say mesa. The mesa. 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 Okay. Now you know a Spanish word. <laughs> table. For today. For today. Um, in Spanish, the word for black is negro. 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 G, g, g. Say G. Make a hard G sound. G. Hard G. G. Like go. Go. go yeah. Go. So negro. Negro. That's the word for black in Spanish. So now you know another word in Spanish. Um, I can say sit down. That's a seate. I say I take. Mm -hmm. That's sit down. I can say stand up. Levantate. 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 Mm -hmm. I can say uh, haircut. Haircut? Mm -hmm. That sounds English. Well, no, that is English. Oh. I'm getting ready to say it in Spanish. Corte de pero. Corte. 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 De pero. De pero. Mm -hmm. So now you can say haircut in Spanish. Corte de pedo. Corte de pedo. Is that haircut? That's haircut. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, Jacqueline Gonzalez and Theo Nesto Gonzalez. This segment is dedicated to you two because I just need you to check and make sure that I'm saying things correctly because I don't want to lead Mima down the wrong path. Okay, so I have, oh, here, have some water. We need to keep you hydrated. Drink some water. Drink some water. Mima doesn't like to drink water, people. So I I have gotten her um, flavored water. The one she's drinking now is a berry flavor. It's very good for her. You know that our body is made mostly of water, right, Mima? Do you know what the word for water is in Spanish? No. Agua. 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 That's water. Um, the word for hot in Spanish. Do you know that? <laughs> no, not few. <laughs> the word for hot in Spanish is caliente. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, see, you're learning so much. You're almost bilingual now. Okay, to help me in my interest in learning to speak Spanish, I have this Duolingo app and I've been practicing. Now, <laughs> a while back while I was practicing, I was feeling really good about myself and I went to the home of one of my clients. His mom and dad are uh, Spanish speaking 
individuals and I very proudly made a statement and I think I first said it to the mom and she said huh and I said oh okay something's not right so she had her husband come in and I said it to him and he said what <laughs> and I said all right something's definitely definitely not right what I was trying to say was I eat you drink uh -huh. I was trying to say I eat you drink what I said was I eat babies <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, goodness. So I got something wrong. So apparently in the Spanish language, um, a lot of the language and a lot of the meaning of different words has to do with the emphasis that you put on different parts of the word. So I guess there's, I hope I get this right, bebes and bebes. One means drink, the other means babies. I guess. But anyway, I, I messed it completely up. So I thought I need a little bit of practice. So Duolingo. So I've been working on Duolingo. I've done the first two units. Today's unit is in ordering food and drink. So Mima and I are going to go through this lesson in how to order food and drink in Spanish, which won't help me at all when I go to Italy since they speak Italian. But, you know, I'll learn that later. We took French, didn't we? You took French in school. What do you remember of French? Probably left it there. <laughs> you don't remember any of your French? No, well, maybe I could, I could dust up some, but I don't know. I, 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 I took English, um, I took French in fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth. Oh, you took a lot. And my freshman year of high school. That was a few years ago. So I don't know what I remember. I just know that the French language and the Spanish language are somewhat similar. So we're going to learn how to order food and drink on Duolingo. So we're going to start this. I don't own the rights to Duolingo either. I don't own the rights to anything. So order food and drink, start. It's loading. Okay. So we're going to say the word salt. 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 Mm -hmm. So it's asking me, it's showing me three pictures and it's asking me which one of these is the salt. And I'm going to say la sal. La sal. Let's see. La sal. La sal. Say la sal. <coughs> la sal. La sal. La sal. No, sal. Sal. You're saying stal. Sal. Al. Stal. <laughs> You're not ready. <laughs> You're not ready to go to Spain. La sal means salt. La sal. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. All right. We got one, folks. Okay. Sin sal. Sin sal. Now I happen to know that sin means without. Sin. 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 Make an S sound. Sin. 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 Yes, that means without. So sin sal. Sin sal is without salt. Oh, oh, sin sal. Okay, so say it again. Sin sal. Sin sal. Without salt. Without salt. So if you were ordering something in Spanish and you didn't want any salt on it, you would say sin sal. Say sin, sin sal. Okay. So, without salt. Let's see if we're correct. Yes, we are. Okay, we got another one. Okay, it says, which one of these is the tomato? I'm going to say el tomate because la sal is salt and la ensalada is salad. La ensalada. Oh, stop it. Uh, the other thing is I also have pictures of the things here. So, the tomato, el tomate. El tomate. El tomate. Say el tomate. El tomate. That means the tomato. Mm -hmm. El tomate. That's correct. Okay, so if we want to say without salt, 
sin sal. No, say sin sal. I forgot it. Mima, say sin sal. Sal, that's without salt. And el tomate is what? Tomate, what does that sound like? The tomato. So if we want a tomato without salt, we would say el tomate sin sal. Okay, I don't like tomatoes, so I'm never going to order one, <laughs> but at least I know how. Do you like tomatoes? Ooh, love them. Ugh. Yeah. No. Okay, so we'll go to the next one. Con tomate. Con tomate. Con tomate. Okay, we know tomate is what? Tomato. Tomato. Con, I am going to say con means with. I'm guessing. Now in French, the word with is avec. 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 And it's French. That's French for with. So it says, it's asking me to write con tomate in English. So I'm going to say with tomato. Mm -hmm. Say con tomate, con tomate with tomato. With tomato. Let's see if that's right. Mm -hmm. It's right. Yeah. Okay, so now the question is asking is which one of these is the salad? Again, we have pictures. It would be great when we go to these foreign countries if every time we wanted to say something, somebody showed us a picture. But they don't. So, la ensalada, la sal, el tomate. So what's mm -hmm. la sal? La what is this? La sal? La what's this a picture of? What's this a picture of? Salt. salt. So la sal is salt. Tomato. El tomate is the tomato. tomato. So, la ensalada is the salad. Oh. Mm -hmm. So say la ensalada. La ensalada. <laughs> say la, la. ensalada. Ensalada. Mm -hmm. A la ensalada. Okay, so that's the salad. Good. So I bet if we said la ensalada con el tomate, we would say we want a salad with, with tomato. tomato. There you go. Okay, see how good we are? <laughs> okay, it says we're crushing it. Una ensalada. Una ensalada. Una. 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 Hmm. That either means one salad or a salad. Let me see. Can I count in Spanish? Uno. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, ses, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. I did it. <laughs> you do it. Uno. Say uno. 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 Dos. One, two. Say dos. Two. Tres. Tres. Cuatro. Cuatro. Uh, I think it's cinco. Cinco. Says. Yes. Siete. Siete. Ocho. Ocho. Nueve. 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 Dis. 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 D. 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 Dis. D. Make a D sound. D. D. Dis. D. Dis. Si. Say dis. Si. Never mind. Okay, una salada. I think I'm gonna say a salad. A salad. Uno. Uno. Una. Uno. Maybe that's one salad. <laughs> I don't know. A salad. I picked a salad. I did it. Uno salada. A salad. Say uno salada. Uno salada. A salad. A salad. Uh, sin, sin, uh, sal without sal without salt. 
Con tomate. With tomato. Yes, with tomato. Good. Jacqueline. Tio Ernesto, aren't you proud of us? We're mm -hmm. learning. Uno o dos. Uno o dos. Uno o dos. Okay, so uno is one. Without? No, uno, one. Remember oh, one. we counted? Dos is two. Dos is two. two. Okay, so she says uno o dos. So I'm guessing this means one or two because they want to know how many salads we want. So if we want one salad, what are we going to say? Uno. Uno. If we want two salads, what are we going to say? Dos. Oh, we want dos. Uh-huh. So let's get two salads. Dos el salada or el salada dos. I can never remember the order that these things go. But I'm thinking somebody will be able to figure out what I want. If all else fails, I will draw a picture. Okay, we were right. Uno o dos means one or two. Okay, fill in the blank. La ensalada con o sin sal. Hmm. La ensalada was that? With salad? No, la ensalada, the salad. The salad, la ensalada. And it's not with salad. It's the salad. La ensalada la is the salad. the salad. Con Oh, sin sal. Okay. Do we want the salad with or without salt? Okay. Do we want salt on our salad? Do we want salt in our salad? I'm asking you. Do we want oh. them to put salt in our salad? Yes. Okay. So, la ensalada con o sin salad. Yes. I don't want salt in my salad. You can have salt in your salad. I don't eat salt much at all. Okay, con o sin tomate, tomata, con o sin tomata, with or without what? What's tomata? Tomato. Tomato. Do we want tomato in our salad? Yes. You can have tomato in your salad. You want tomato I don't salad? like tomatoes really? at all. Oh, there's not a salad about tomato. Yes, it is. It's the other stuff. Okay, con o sin tomate, tomata, sin tomata. Good. Okay. You got a salad with salt and tomatoes. I have a salad without salt and tomatoes. La cuenta, por favor. La cuenta, por favor. We're asking for something, please. La cuenta. What do we think cuenta means? La cuenta, por favor. We know it's not water. You remember what water is? Agua. Okay, so it's not water. Excuse me. Mm, I don't think it's that. Fish. It's not fish because fish is pesca something. Um, and the only reason I remember that is if you're a pescatarian, you eat fish, but no other meat. You just eat fish. That's, so it's not fish. Please, that's the por favor part, please. Thanks. What's thanks in Spanish? Gracias. Say gracias. Say gracias. Gracias. Check. I'm thinking that that means check because we're in a restaurant and we have to pay before we leave or they're going to arrest us. Mm -hmm. and we don't want to be arrested in a foreign country, right? Okay, so I'm going to hit this speaker again. La cuenta, por favor. La cuenta, por favor. I think they're saying check, please. Uh -huh. Say, say la cuenta. La cuenta. Por favor. Mm. Por favor. Por favor. Mm -hmm. May I have the check, please? And oh no, it's not the check. La cuenta. It's not water. It's not fish. I'm stuck. Cuenta. My choices are the, water, excuse me, fish, please, and thanks. And none of that seems to make sense to me. La cuenta, por favor. I don't like any of the options. I'm going to say, 
I'm just gonna pick something. It's not, I know it's not water. Water is agua. Mm -hmm. And fish is pesca something. I'm so confused. Um, I know thanks is gracias. Mm, 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 mm. I don't like any of these options. Let me take a sip of hot chocolate and think about it. What do you think I should pick? Do you think I should pick the, water, excuse me, fish, please, or thanks? I don't know. Meaning you're not helping. <laughs> Guy, what does cuenta mean in Spanish? Uh, okay. I'm just going to pick water. I know it's wrong. Oh, it says continue. How do you say check? It was Quinta. <laughs> because it says reserva. Say reserva. 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 Red. Okay. Quinta. Quinta. Naranja. Naranja. That's an orange. That's mm -hmm. orange, like a piece of fruit orange. Naranja. Okay, so I'm going to say check is Quinta. Quinta. Yes, so why wasn't that right when I said Yo check? Necesito la cuenta. Yo necesito la cuenta. Okay, we have to say this. Say Joe. Say Joe. Yo necesita, necesita la cuenta. La cuenta. Pronounce that e like a long day. What e? Cuenta, C U E N T A. Cuenta. Cuenta. Okay, so Joe. Joe. Necesita. Necesita la cuenta. La cuenta. Joe. Joe. Necesito. Necesito la cuenta. La cuenta. Okay, so we're gonna say it in the speaker. Ready? Joe, Joe, necesito, necesito, la cuenta, la cuenta. Yes, we got it. Go <laughs> us. We're gonna be ready by the end of the week. Yo quiero pagar. Yo quiero pagar. What? Pagar. Yo quiero. Yo quiero. Where is? No. I I want Paga. I want to pay. Joe. Okay, we're gonna say this, Mimi. Joe quiero pagar. Joe. Joe quiero. Piano. Not piano. Quiero. Quiero. Pagua. Joe. Joe. Pierre. Wait, wait. Joe. Joe. Quiero. Pagua. I want to pay. I want to pay, to pay, pay, you got it, okay, select the matching pairs, to pay, paga, so we're going to say to pay goes with paga, paga, okay, four, Okay, we're gonna skip that. Juice, Hugo. I think the J is pronounced like an H. Hugo, Hugo, Hugo. Okay, glass is going to be vaso. Vaso. Good. Bread is going to be para. Para. No. Bread is pan. Pan. Bread is pan. Pan. Say pan. Pan. That means bread. Bread. And four. And four. Para. Para. Okay, good. Yo quiero una ensalada. Yo quiero ensalada. Yo quiero. Ensalada. Ensalada. Yo quiero ensalada. I want a salad. Say yo. Sí, yo. Quiero. 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 Quiero
Quero. Quero. Ensalada. Ensalada. You want a salad? Yeah. Okay. Say yeah in Spanish. Oui. Si. That was French. Oh. We is French. <laughs> si. Mm -hmm. Yo quiero ensalada. Quiero ensalada. What? Yo quiero... Oh, I forgot the uno. Mm -hmm. Okay. I forgot a word. Okay, so now we're going over the ones that we missed. Pay attention. La cuenta, por favor. La cuenta, la cuenta, por favor. La cuenta, la cuenta, por favor. Por, por favor. favor. The check, please. Oh. Okay, so the check, please. Please. Okay, gotta write that time. Yo quiero una ensalada. Yo quiero ensalada. Yo quiero ensalada. I want a salad. Yo, say yo. Say yo. yo. Quiero. Quiero. Una. Una. Ensalada. Una. I want a salad. Ensalada. I don't want no stinking salt or tomatoes on it. So, sin. Sal e sin tomate. Okay. We completed that lesson. Go us. Mima, over here. High five. We completed the lesson. Okay, so we got 88%. 88. Mm -hmm. That's not bad. Okay, let's go to the next lesson. To continue. Uh, what? You found a nice job reaching your daily goal. Okay. I don't know why that's there, but I don't want it. Super nice. No thanks. They want to sell me things, Mima. Okay. Maintain your streak for seven more days and we'll double your. Five lingo, lingo, wager, lingot, lingo, whatever that is. Okay, so now we're still ordering food and drink. So far, we can order a salad. We can order a salad without salt. We can order a salad without tomato. But we're probably going to get hungry and want some other things. Let's see what we can order here. It's loading. So we're going to wrap up this level. Okay, let's review the exercises you missed. Okay, I thought we already did, but I guess we're going to do it again. La cuenta, por favor. La cuen cuenta. La cuenta. La cuenta. Por favor. Por favor. Por favor. What is that? What does that mean? We finish eating and what do we need to do? We're in a restaurant, we finish eating. Oh, what do we need to do? Me. No, we're in a restaurant. Oh, that we finished. We are. We're in a restaurant. We ate our food. Thank you. Thank you, but they want something besides thank you. Oh, okay. Yes. So la cuenta, the check. Por favor. Por favor. Please. Yes. Check me. La cuenta, por favor. The check. Please. Okay. Yo quiero una ensalada. Yo quiero ensalada. Yo quiero ensalada. I want a salad. Yo. Say yo. Yes. No. Say yo. Oh. Yo. Quiero. Quiero. Una, una, ensalada. I want a salad. Yo quiero una ensalada. Ensalada. Yo quiero una ensalada. Got it. What does that mean? Yo quiero, yo quiero una ensalada. I want a salad. Yeah. Sin sal, without salt. Sin sal. 
Sin of fear. Sal. Without salt. Without salt. Without salt. Okay. Okay. Ah, here we go. They want us to write in Spanish a fish sandwich. Okay. I know that pescado is fish. So a fish sandwich. What I'm not sure is if we're going to say un pescado sandwich or if we're going to say un sandwich de, de, de pescado. I think we're going to say un sandwich. Sandwich. Oh, sandwich. De. de pescado. Pescado. Say un. Un. Say un. Mm. Sandwich. De. 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 Make a D sound. De. De. De pescado. 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 Un sandwich de pescado. I say that's a fish sandwich. Let's see if I'm right. I am right. So are you. Ah. They want me to say an orange juice. An orange juice. So, um. Who go? Day naranja, naranja. I said that for Dana. Naranja, naranja. So un, say un. Who go? Who go? Who go? Who go? Day, day, naranja. 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 Who go de Nahanga and orange juice? Who go Yeah. We got it. Mm -hmm. Okay. They're going to give us some hard stuff now. You mean that wasn't it? That wasn't it. Una hamburguesa de pescado. Una hamburguesa de pescado. A hamburger with fish? No. Uno hamburguesa de pescado. That's one something that's fish. It's not sand. Excuse me. It's not sandwich. Hamburguesa. Hamburguesa de pescado. Let's say a... Burger, a fish burger, a fish burger. I left out check because I know this. That's not in there. Meat. Table is mesa. Well, that's the one. Okay, I'm thinking uno hamburguesa de pescado. Say uno. Uno. Hamburguesa. De. De pescado. pescado. I think that's a fish burger. Let's see. Yes! <laughs> it's a fish burger. I don't want a fish burger. Is a fish burger the same as hamburger except you use fish? That's what I'm thinking, but I don't want it. I would do. I want a fish sandwich. Yeah. But I don't want a fish burger because to me a fish burger is ground fish. Mm -hmm. Ooh, ick, yuck, gross. Okay. Fill in the blank. Yo, something uno hamburger, hamburguesa con carne. Con carne. Um, carne, that's meat. Okay. Yo, something. Una hamburguesa con carne. I think it's yo bebo. Bebo? Maybe that's eat? But that's how I got in trouble before when I said I eat babies. Yo, yo, because the Y is just. Yo bebo una hamburguesa con carne. I'm eating a hamburger with meat. Yo bebo. Yo bebo una hamburguesa con carne. Let's see. No. 
Yo como una hamburguesa con carne. I eat a burger with meat. Yo como. Como must mean eat. So say yo como. Yo como. Una. Una. Hamburguesa. 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 Con um, carne. Carne. I eat a burger with meat. Maybe Bebo was drinking. Un sandwich de queso. Un sandwich de queso. Some kind of a sandwich. Queso. Cheese. Cheese. Queso. Yes. Un sandwich de queso. Say un. Say un. Mm -hmm. Sandwich. One sandwich. No. One. Well, yes. Yes. Day. Day. With. Day. Say day. Day. Queso. 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 So, okay. so, un sandwich de queso. Un sandwich de queso. I believe that means a fish sandwich. Not a fish sandwich, a cheese sandwich. Oh. Queso, I believe, is cheese. A cheese sandwich. Un sandwich de queso, a cheese sandwich. Yep. Okay, fill in the blank. El Hombre Blank Cafe. Okay, this is a man drinking coffee. I know this one. I know this one. El Hombre Bebe Cafe. Now, the only issue is, am I saying Bebe right? Is it Bebe or is it Bebe? But I want the one that means drink. El Hombre Bebe Cafe. El Hombre El hombre. El hombre. Bebe. Bebe. Café. Café. The man drinks coffee. Bebe. 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 Not baby. Oh, bebe. 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 Yes. El hombre bebe café. The man drinks coffee. Okay. Mm -hmm. They even told us we did that nicely. Yo quiero pagar la cuenta. Yo quiero pagar la cuenta. Okay. Yo quiero. I want. To pay the check, I want to pay the check. Yo quiero. Check. Check. Yo. Yo. Quiero. quiero. Pagar. 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 La, la cuenta. Cuenta. Yo quiero pagar la cuenta. I want to pay the check. I want to pay the check. Got it. Yo quiero pagar la cuente. Una taza de café, por favor. What? Tap what you hear. Okay, I'll say it again. Una taza de café, por favor. Una taza de café, por favor. Una, una taza, taza de, de café, café por, por, por favor. favor. Okay, I'm doing something with coffee, please. Mm -hmm. Una taza, taza, taza. Let's see what that means. A cup of coffee, please. You know, you need to learn how to say that. Una taza. Una taza. Una taza. Una taza. Una taza. 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 No. Ta. Ta. Taza. Taza. Day. Day. Cafe. Cafe. Por favor. Por favor. Una taza. Una taza. Day. 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 Cafe. Cafe. Por favor. Por favor. Una taza. Una taza. Una taza. Una taza. Day. Day. Cafe. Cafe. Por favor. Por favor. I want a cup of coffee, please. Un jugo de naranja. Por favor. Un 
Huga de Naranga, por favor. Un Huna, un Huna, un Let's hear it again. Un Huga. Un Huga. Un jugo de naranja, por favor. Un jugo de naranja, de, un jugo de naranja, por favor. A hey. glass of orange juice, please. Un jugo. Un jugo. Un jugo. Un jugo de okay. naranja, naranja, por favor. Por favor. Un jugo mm -hmm. de, 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 de. <laughs> Naranja, por favor. Por favor. Okay. Um, Hugo. Hugo. Whoops. Not baby. Get out of there. Hugo. Day. Say day. Day. Naranja. 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 Por. 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 Favor. Un jugo de naranja, por favor. A, some orange juice, please. A glass of orange juice? An orange juice, please. Okay. So now we got a salad without salt, without tomato. We've got some coffee, and we've got an orange juice. Uno, dos. A salad without coffee, with a salad without tomato, or... Oh. We've got a salad without salt. Salt. Oh, a, a salad without tomato. What's in the salad here? Lettuce and spinach and broccoli and oh. cheese oh, okay. and stuff. I mean, I'm just thinking of what I like. Yeah, you like stuff on yours. Okay, we got to do this one. Uno, dos. Uno, dos. Okay, uno, uno. dos. Dos. Oh, uno, dos. Uh-huh. One. Two. Uno. Dos. Uno, dos. Uno, dos. One, two. One, two. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, uno, o oh, dos. One or two. Uno, o oh, dos. I left uno, out the o. Oh. Oh, that was my fault. Joe blank uno hamburguesa con carne. Joe como. Joe como uno Hamburguesa con carne. Yo, yo como, como uno, una uno. hamburguesa, hamburguesa. Con, con carne. carne. Yo, yo como, como una, una hamburguesa, hamburguesa con, con carne. carne. So, yo, mm. como. Como, como. Yes, I eat a burger with meat. Uno o dos. Uno o dos. One or two. Uno. 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 O. 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 Dos. Do. Dos. Dos. One or two. Dos. One or two. Good. Okay. We completed another level. I think that's enough for today. What do you think? Okay. All right. Well, let us know what you all think of our ability to speak Spanish. Okay. We can ask for a salad. We can ask for a salad without salt. We can ask for a salad without tomato. Nuts? We didn't do anything with nuts today. I thought we did. I thought we did one without nuts. No. Okay. No. No. You're making things up, me. <laughs> um, we can order coffee. We can order orange juice. We can order a fish burger. I don't want a fish burger. I want a fish sandwich. <laughs> um, we can count somewhat. And I think that's it. So, guys, let us know what you think of our ability. Let us know whether or not we impressed you with our intellect. So, until we meet again, everybody have a wonderful rest of the day. And enjoy your holiday tomorrow. And everybody stay safe. Thank you. Okay. Say goodbye, Mima. Adios. Mima said adios. Okay. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah, okay. Yes. That's the goodbye in Spanish. Adios. adios. Uh -huh.
Alright.